Hi guys! As you can see, today we are going to be opening up the Uglies house, this pet shop, pet store, and then I've also got all of the other pet store, um, what do you call these, the add-ons for it. So I'm just going to get started with opening these and we will take a look at each one. I'm going to start with the house first and I'll be right back as I go ahead and get that open. Okay guys, so I kind of have it open. <laughs> um, I'm just going to take out the base and get the cardboard. This is this one's really cute, but I need to get that cardboard out of there. Over here, so here is the base. <laughs> here's another one of the houses and then here's the top special pet that we get with this set and this is the manic monkey he's pretty gross I like him though he's really cool and then here's the house so it comes with this base which has its own little home Do I need batteries for this? Maybe this one just doesn't make noise. Maybe not because it doesn't have a sound. Like this one you can see has a sound, like dots in the ground for sound and this one doesn't. So maybe this one does not. It does have a door so you can put your ugly in there, put him in there. And then um, we've got this guy. See that one does make noise. Oh. The monkey belongs in here. <laughs> gross. Lots of different gross sounds. This makes, I also, I'm going to take this guy out. It also has some funny newspaper detailing there. It's probably, you're not going to be able to read it on camera, but it's really funny. Then it's got like this little box where you can set another ugly. You know, just really, really cool. And then here is the top. The top is also awesome. It says the Ugly's Pet Shop with a couple little animals. Um, it's got paw prints on the top of it, sausages, a ball got stuck on the top of the roof. And then you put this here, and when you press it down, <laughs> more noises. The different homes that we have to put on top. And we'll start with this one. This is the Slobrador, and um, these are all, all like this pet, and then all of these pets here in these different homes, they're all exclusive to the home. You cannot get these pets any other way, just through these, and that's why I wanted to get these as well, um, not only because they make awesome noises and you can store pets in here, but because you get exclusive pets. So this is the Slobrador. This is the Doggy Dump. <laughs> so we'll get this one opened. Oh, what is this? Okay, hang on. Sorry guys, I got interrupted with a phone call, but I wanted to show you guys this. I just took it out of the package and look, this looks like surprise poop to me. <laughs> um, so it comes with, it looks like maybe some instruction, or not instructions, but um, a warning or saying that this um, toy complies with some laws. <clears throat> Excuse me. It comes with a checklist, it looks like. Well, we'll get the home out. Here is the home. These ones are a little bit different than the others, and then this one here. It has a roof. Get the cardboard out. And really cool, this one looks like it's got like maggots in it and then it's got this piece of paper that's all ripped up that says final exam and some keys down in there. Um, then it's just kind of boarded up and broken down. Oh, there's a spider hanging out in the back here. And then the roof is also really cool. Not exactly sure. That's a blue steak, but I don't know what that is. Here is our Slobrador. He's got some toilet paper that he's been chewing on. A little bit slimy there. And we'll put him... And I also really like the golden bone on the front of his house. 
So we'll put the lid on. Oh, so sad. Ugh, not sad anymore. <laughs> oh, he must have a bouncy ball. All right, so we will put this one on here. They just snap in. And then we'll open our poop here that we got. I don't, I wonder if all of them come with it or if it's just kind of random. I'm not really sure. Ooh, here is an awesome poop. I do not have this one yet. It's green, disgusting, sticky poop. So maybe we'll put that in there with him. Well, no, we'll put it out here. We don't want their cages to get dirty. Uh, go on to this one. This is the blubbering bulldog. And again, he's exclusive and he's got his own little home. So let's get him opened up. And this is, yeah, his is the mutt hut. So I got it open and as you can see, this one also has a blind poop and this one is very large. His house has a green steak and a red whatever that is. <laughs> and here's the cardboard cutout of him. I really like those, they're adorable. His mutt hut has a yellow bone on the front. Sort of similar with the um, spider and the holes. And let's see if they make different noises. Different noises, definitely. And then here's the blubbering bulldog. He's adorable, I really like this one. <laughs> he's got a bone and he's not giving it up. It looks like he got a black eye from protecting it. And then he's just got some green ooze coming out. Put him in his home. And, and I know I will have to take off the roofs to put more on. But for now, I'm just leaving them there. And now we'll open up our blind mystery poop. Oh, wow. It is big. Here is our blind mystery poop for the bulldog. Pretty nasty. Much, much bigger than this one. We'll put that one on the newspaper. You see here um, the start of the checklist because I didn't realize that he was first on the checklist but since he is I'm just gonna go in order so next is the spitting kitten I'm really excited for this one um, here is the spitting kitten and this one's home is called the cat shack I was right not all of them come with it this one did not come with a blind poop so that's fine I just wasn't sure if they all came with it or some of them came with it, you know, but so far so good. We got two poops. So here is the Spittin' Kitten home. It's different than the uh, the dog homes. Um, this one has a silver fish because it's a kitty cat. And then just kind of some green slime all over the roof. It's got some feathers, um, some uh, bird prints, bird tracks. Um, looks like the cat was scratching on its home. Let's get out the cardboard piece. And then on the sides, it's almost like it's a um, like a carton that you would take home an animal in. And it looks like there's a little mouse door. More slime and ooze and some cat claw prints. And then, yeah, just really cool. I really like this one. And let's see what sounds it makes. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> that one's cute. Then here's the kitten. It looks like it's spitting up some yarn. And it's got a little, maybe a trash can lid on the top of its head. Super, super cute. Super gross. It's got a little, you see his little tooth poking out there from underneath the slime. He's got a fish bone on him. Super cute. Love this one. And now we'll have to take off one of the roofs to put him up. All right, I'll show you guys. There we go. 
And then when you press them down, they all make noise. That's awesome. The Cracker Parrot. And as you can see, he is a parrot. And his home is one of my favorites. I think it's so funny. It's the Poop Coop. <laughs> so we're gonna get him open so we can take a look. Container also does not have a blind poop. Poop Coop. It's pretty awesome. There's some ants curling along the bottom. And then on the top, we've got an apple core, a banana peel. Take the top off. Get the cardboard out. Um, so there's some slime oozing around the bird cage. Oh, looks like he broke out at one point. Some more slime, some scratches. Maybe the cat was trying to get in. Pretty cool. And the inside's got some feathers and some poop. Then here is the Cracker Parrot itself. Really adorable. Kind of a smaller one. I like it. Um, I don't see anything too gross with this one. Oh, his wings are different sizes. I wonder if he can fly. Doesn't seem like he would be able to. But he's cool. Put him in his home. Can't see that. Sorry, guys. And then we'll need to take off... Oops, another lid to put them on there. Wow, look at that. Our stack is getting quite large. Hang on. There we go. Wow, let's see. It looks like it's gonna be Chucky Chihuahua back here. So this one's also really adorable. He's a Chihuahua. And his home is called the Bone Home, which is also really cool. Look guys, we got some surprise poop. Awesome. This is Chucky Chihuahua's Bone Home. And he's got a silver bone. This one was gold, remember? And I really like his house. I like the red and the white together. Take off. And he's got a kind of yellowy orange steak on the top of his. Flea bitten. So his home is very similar to the other puppy homes. It's got the spider rub on the back and the holes where they're trying to chew out. And there's some maggots in there. And here's Chucky Chihuahua. Very, very cute. I love him. He's scratching the fleas like he was in the picture. And then it looks like he's sitting on his, um, maybe his favorite towel or rug or blankie. So we'll put him in there. Okay. Would you listen to all those noises? And it does kind of tip, but once you put the top on, it won't tip like that. Leaning Tower of Uglies. <laughs> so I'm gonna take the lid off of the spitting kitten. All right, and now we've got the mystery poop that came with our Chucky Chihuahua. <gasps> you guys, look! It's a golden poop! That's awesome, I don't have this golden poop. Super cool. Nice. Our final gross home is the gross goldfish. And this is the rank tank and no poop because fish don't have normal poop like dogs and cats do. Here is the rank tank and I do believe this is my favorite one. Um, it looks like maybe a gecko was crawling on the top of the rank tank. And I really, really like this one because the plastic is semi see-through. So it really does look like a fish tank. A really disgusting, dirty fish tank. <laughs> Looks like there's some band-aids holding the cracked glass shut. Some more band-aids on the back here and it's just real slimy. So we'll put the gross goldfish in the tank and he's just nasty. He's actually a really gross one, but I really, really like him. Okay. Oh, 
All right, so here's what we're gonna do. If I can, I don't think I'll be able to. So I'm gonna put these on top. Ooh, leaning tower. So here are all of our gross homes put together. And then there is a spot for one on the top. So I could um, take one off the stack and put it on the top. But this is really tall, really awesome. And like I said, all of these pets are all exclusive to these homes. So this is the only way that you can get these pets. And then here's the <laughs> lids for their homes. So I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for the coming days for more Uglies Pet Shop videos. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.